everyone, so we're going to continue with our multivariate regression model. And again, we were regressing our ARC returns on the Russell Growth Index and Russell Value Index. And we wanted to test whether the coefficient on the Russell Growth Index, the returns on that, is statistically significant. So our null hypothesis is that the coefficient V1 equals 0. Our alternative hypothesis states that the coefficient does not equal 0. Again, we're looking at this coefficient on V1 is the coefficient in Russell Growth Index. V2 is the coefficient on the Russell Value Index. And we're are stating our null hypothesis is that this is 0. Our alternative hypothesis, the interesting hypothesis, is that it is not equal to 0. And again, we do the same thing for beta 2, for B2 here. So let's begin building our regression model. So we already cleaned up our data. Now when we need to import stats models dot api as sm and there's two ways we can build out this model if you're familiar with r programming we can do it that way or we can do the normal python route so i'm going to begin assuming that a lot of you are familiar with r and we will do that route first so first we need to import from patsy import d matrices so essentially this is going to help us write in r so we can just say y x, so this is going to be our dependent variable and our independent variables, equals d matrices, arc, that's the name of our variable. We're going to use a tilde, rlg, plus rlv. And we can just say data equals our data frame that we already created in our last video. Return type equals data frame. And that's all we need to do. So we'll run that. And we can take a look at what our data looks like. So we have our y values. There we go. And we have our x values. So notice this already included an intercept for us. The other way we can do it is if you're not familiar with R, we can just create this ourselves. So we can just say y equals data frame. And again, arc is the column that we're interested in. And for x variables, we are interested, and we have to put this in two brackets, RLG, RLV. And again, we should get the same output. There we go. And remember, there's no intercept here, so we need to add it. So we can do that by taking x equals sm dot add constant x, x dot head, there we go. So you notice we have the same output like we did here. It's just easier to do it all in one line like so. So there we go. And now we need to actually build our model. And so to do that, we're going to say model equals sm dot ols. And we'll put in our y variables and our x variables. We've built a model and now we need to fit it. So we'll say model.fit. We're going to output this into results. That's results. Results.summary. And now we can output. And there it is. There's our results.summary. So in our next video, we'll go into the details of each of these statistics and determine if we can reject our null and alternative hypotheses. So till next time, thank you.